Yeah, Mark, a much better performance today and a result to match. Yeah, I thought it was a good performance today. Um, it was more compact and we passed the ball well. Um, we kept the ball for longer periods and um, I think we've run out deserved winners today. OK, Matt, two goals for you today and a win as well. Perfect debut. Uh, yeah, we'd have, we'd have topped off if I, the left-footed shot would have went in to get a hat-trick. But like I said, I've come here to obviously try and help Chelmsford push, uh, push on towards the league and, that, and um, obviously coming in and getting two goals was a great start for me. What did you say to the team before the match? Obviously, you would have been disappointed with the performance last week. Came out of intent and creating some more chances as well. Yeah, the last you know two weeks before today has been a little bit. Um, we've been a little bit open. Um, I think we lost at home to Oxford on the back of a very hard week. Um, but last week we let ourselves down. Um, saying that we still had chances last week, but I think this week uh, we've worked hard in training we obviously brought in another player and we've changed the team around from last week and that's worked we just wanted to be more compact we wanted to pass the ball um, better and we did and I wanted us to keep the ball for longer periods and we did that and um, we've come out 2-1 winners today and on another day we probably might have scored you know another one or two maybe three more and a word on Matt Wichlow obviously came in on loan from Boreham Wood he provided that integral link really between the midfield and attack which has been lacking lately hasn't it I think, um, yeah, that's the sort of player I've been looking for for a long time and um, I've been working on that deal since last Sunday morning. Uh, there's been several phone calls between myself and uh, Luke at Bourne Wood and uh, they've helped us out massively. And, um, you know, he's a great player. He's used to winning, used to keeping the ball and obviously had that winner mentality from Bourne Wood from the their promotion last season so he's, he's ideal and he scored two goals on his debut so it don't come much better than that for him. What are your first impressions of your new teammates from this afternoon? Uh, a great bunch of lads and hard working bunch of boys so obviously if we can keep that hard work up and be clinical in our box and eradicate mistakes in our, in, in the fin in our defensive third then we'll do alright. He's got that experience as well hasn't he to help out these younger players in the squad? Yeah it's experience and know-how, knowing how to win games and you know and he did keep the ball uh, for us and he joined the, the attack up and um, you know he's, he's had two other great strikes that have just dipped over the bar so you know let's um, let's hope we can uh, as a side improve around that and um, enjoy his company for the next three months and if he plays like that for three months uh, we'd be in a very healthy position. And even though Basingstoke haven't lost a haven't won a game yet this this season in the league you know they've still pose a threat didn't they? Yes most definitely they've got they've got big um big lads in there sort of for the aerial balls and stuff like that. Um, they'll cause teams problems and uh, it's only a matter of time before they get a win and obviously thank thankfully it wasn't against us today. And of course we had to still do our bit defensively but we stood strong to the test and you know even though they are bottom of the table they prevent you know cause plenty of problems. Yes I mean they're still a good side. Um, it's only you know only six months ago they was in the playoffs um, and it's the same team it's the same squad. Um, so we've done well to come and win here. Um, you know, we've, we've got to keep going now. We've got to get on another run ourselves now. You know, we went on a run earlier of seven games unbeaten. Um, the cup games are put to bed for a little while and we've got to run a league game. So can we um, get back on, on a winning trail and, and go unbeaten for five or six games? And if we do that, um, we'll be in a health position in the league.